10 wrestlers fans want as a 2K pre-order bonus character. Number 10, Batista. In recent years, WWE has used the pre-order bonus 2K character to mend bridges with former legends and it has helped open the door for the likes of Sting, Kurt Angle, and Goldberg, all to return to the company in some capacity. This is likely going to be the case with this year's bonus character, which is Rey Mysterio, and a perfect example of someone that 2K should look at for the year after is the animal Batista, a man who is very open to a wrestling return. He has stated that he wants to come back to WWE and using his star power as an actor to help sell some video games seems like a win-win situation for everybody, opening the door for a potential WrestleMania run and a retirement angle. Number 9, Chris Benoit. It may be a controversial entry as many fans absolutely do not want to see Chris Benoit as a video game character and do not ever want to see him involved in any wrestling related content again, agreeing with WWE's decision to blacklist him. However, there's also a large number of fans who would love to see Chris Benoit recognized for his incredible wrestling career and one way to possibly do that could come from 2K gaming series as the company does create things without WWE. 2K went out of their way to bring Sting in, which eventually led to his WWE debut, and they could potentially do the same adding Benoit as a bonus character. That way, he isn't a fully featured character and likely only the hardcore fans who truly just respect his wrestling career would buy it. Number 8, Hulk Hogan. Just like the last option, this would be a controversial entry, but given Hulk Hogan's legendary status, he is a name that absolutely should be involved in all WWE related video games as fans want to be able to play as him. There have been many rumors and rumblings that he's in talks to return to the company with WWE itself and an easy way to test out the waters of how people would react could be via the next 2K video game. Gauging how people respond to the Hulkster being put into a game as an added bonus for early purchases could give WWE an idea as to how people would feel if he returned to the ring and could open the door up for that. Number 7, Kenny Omega. While 2K has primarily used their pre-order bonus character for former WWE and WCW legends, what if they use it to tease a brand new signing or capitalize on someone who had already just signed? If WWE could bring in Kenny Omega, who is arguably the greatest wrestler in the world right now, wrestling fans would certainly want to play with them in the video game and that is something that 2K would have to be prepared for. While it's very unlikely WWE will allow the video game to break the news, it could come from a link that Omega has with Xavier Woods, Up Up Down Down channel, simply having him involved in the game and nothing else, which would be a cool a unique twist. Number 6. NXT roster. This would take a lot of work for the 2K team and it's likely not going to happen, but there is a potential that they could create an NXT edition where the entire full sale roster is jam packed into the game, only for the pre-order bonus. The 2K games now feature NXT and have done for a couple of years. They don't normally use the entire roster, often picking the most popular and recognizable names. But what if they use everyone on the roster? Having the ability to see different wrestlers get called up to the main roster could be a lot of fun and add a new dynamic to the game rather than just your own character moving up. And given the passionate number of NXT fans, this is something that could see very well. Number 5, NWO. Arguably the greatest stable in the history of wrestling, there's no doubt that an NWO edition of the game as a 2K pre-order bonus would go down well. While we used Hulk Hogan on his own as an example earlier, if the company's not feeling confident, then putting him in via the group could be another way around that. Having the cover be black and white with the infamous NWO logo spray painted on would make for a really neat aesthetic and being able to play as a group and pit them against the likes of New Day or Undisputed Era would be very fun for newer and older fans. While it might not bring Hulk Hogan back to the company, it could lead into a Hall of Fame induction for the group, something that all three men certainly deserve and would just be a cool and unique element for the game. Number 4, Ronda Rousey. Depending on the timing, the deal that saw Ronda Rousey join WWE in time for a WrestleMania 34 debut might have to come too late for her to actually have been placed into the video game, meaning 2K19 might actually not have Rousey featured. She could become a downloadable character that fans have to purchase later on in the year, but that won't receive the same impact and only a select number will actually go on to buy that, which opens up the door for a potential 2K20 pre-order bonus. After a year, it is likely Rousey will 
will have even a bigger star power in the world of wrestling and will likely have become women's champion which means many people will want to play as her, making her an excellent idea as a pre-order bonus. Number 3. China Since WWE began bringing names in as a 2K bonus characters who were previously not talked about such as Sting or Goldberg, now could be the time to bring a woman into that for the first time and there's nobody more iconic or deserving than China. One of the greatest female performers in wrestling, China is a name who does not get talked about enough by WWE and the fact she never made the Hall of Fame before she passed away is incredibly sad. However, WWE can still pay their respect by including her into the video game and potentially following it up with the Hall of Fame induction the year after. Number 2. CM Punk Now that his UFC career is certainly finished, CM Punk's attention may turn back to what he does best, professional wrestling. While Punk has stated many times he doesn't want to return to the company, time tends to heal all wounds and he's clearly starting to very slowly open the door back to professional wrestling. The rumors of his potential appearance at the upcoming All In event would only further spark a possible WWE return and you have to think that at some point in his lifetime, Punk will make a comeback and placing himself into a video game could be a way to convince him back. First of all, Punk wouldn't actually have a deal with WWE as he would be working with 2K instead of Vince McMahon but it would allow a communication to open. Either way, Punk is certainly a character that wrestling fans would love to see as a pre-order bonus. Number 1. Owen Hart When it comes to wrestlers who WWE fans are desperate to see talked about more, Owen Hart is always going to be in the conversation with many fans and fellow wrestlers frustrated that one of the greatest wrestlers in history is not given the respect deserved. The real reason that Owen is not in the Hall of Fame or used in video games or TV packages is because his widow doesn't want him to be due to the way in which Owen Hart died. But eventually, that is surely going to change. Bret Hart has called for it to happen on many occasions and played Placing Owen Hart into a video game could be a small baby step in order to increasing his involvement with the company and he's certainly a character fans are desperate to play as.